coverage of the two Buffalo found dead on Mir a Mears man's property after they were shot by staff with the Wichita Mountains Wildlife Refuge. The Comanche Nation, who has significant ties with the animal, are reacting to the news. Seven News spoke with an official with the Comanche Nation's Historic Preservation Officer Office. She says she is saddened that the buffalo were killed and then left to rot on the man's property with no recourse, adding that their sudden death did not give the Comanche Nation time to plan a proper ceremony for the buffalo. We want to make sure if these actually did have disease, how come they weren't tested as soon as they were shot and why did they have to be shot? You know, they should have been testing these animals, you know, rounding them up. That's just uh, insane that they didn't try to do more to protect those animals and landowners. Minthorn says the fate of the Comanche people and the buffalo have been linked for hundreds of years. She says whenever a buffalo dies, every part of the animal is used from the bones to the skin, fur, and meat. Unfortunately, due to the circumstances surrounding the buffalo's death, Minthorn says these traditions were not able to be followed.